G'day and welcome to Fun with Canva. In today's tutorial, we are going to create this frame layout. So as you can see, I've used frames, inserted an image, and then spread it out over these frames to create this look. And I've added a few shadows. So without further ado, let's get started. So basically what we're going to do is Come over to elements we are going to add a frame square frame we are going to enlarge it and keep it centered <coughs> with that we're going to duplicate it and we'll place that there <coughs> duplicate that place that there and we'll send these layers backwards and we will duplicate it one more time and duplicate it one more time and send that layer backwards. Okay, so we've got three there for the purposes of this tutorial. I will send that one backwards and send that one backwards. All right, so we've got one, two, three, one, two, three. So what we're going to do is we're going to reduce that down and reduce that down and then we'll place that in the center. We'll do the same to this one down to that height and down to that height. Then we'll take this one, reduce that one down and reduce that one down, place that in the center, do the same over here, and do the same to this one, and just make sure that's centered. Okay, so we have our main frame, side frame, side frame, side frame, and side frame, all placed behind each other. So what we're going to do now is come over here and I've used this photo before. So landscape country. We'll choose that photo. We'll place that in the furthest frame. And to make sure it fits within all these frames, we're going to double click it. We'll drag this over to the edge of the frame. Drag this up. And what you want to make sure of is that it's lined up at the top of the frame and then drag it over to the furthest frame edge and line it up there. So there you have your first uh, image within the frame. Then all you want to do is repeat that process. Okay. Line that up there. Up to the top. and line it up again over this side okay then you want to grab the photo again put it in the center frame and double click it move it over here line it up with this side Okay, not quite.
All right, just got to fiddle with this a little bit just to make sure it lines up. All right, that looks okay. Go done. All right, grab the next, enter in there, drag that over. Down, line it up with that, line it up with the top, and drag it over, okay, that looks alright there, and then grab the last one, line it up in there, double click, drag it over, Line it up with the top. Okay. And there you have your photos within the frames. So now what you want to do is add a shadow. So I'm going to use this border shadow. So basically we want to insert that, rotate it to 90 degrees and we're going to first click on it press the control button and we're going to place it next to all these frames click it press the control button click it press the control button all right now with these shadows we want to send it backwards each one backwards okay so we have this look here okay so we have that look there behind then what, we'll, what we want to do is we want to duplicate those. We want to rotate it the other way. Click it, press the control button. We want to come over here. Okay, layer, send backwards. Duplicate, click it, press the control button. Come over here. Send backwards, duplicate, and send backwards. All right, so as you can see there, we have just check this, send backwards. Okay, and send this one backwards. A bit fiddly here. Okay, so there, there you go. You can basically see that we've got the main uh, frame there with the frames behind, we've got the shadows, and we're pretty much set. So we just need to go to layers, show layers, and come down here and we change the background to black. All right, and you can see there that we've got the shadows, 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 and that's pretty much it. So really appreciate uh, you spending the time to look at this tutorial. Hope you'll learn something and stay tuned for the next one. Thank you very much and bye for now.